one of the powers of this technology is that we can show you the viewpoint of multiple members of the team. And so you're in an immersive environment, but we can put you in anesthesia perspective, in the scrub nurse perspective, and, and put you right in the middle of an emergency. So knowing what a smart guy you are, I'm gonna assume that you've made some correct decisions here, um, but really this is, would be the start of a scenario that's designed to get the resident in the mode, excited, fearful, and feeling what it's really like to be managing an emergency. So at that point, what we do essentially is to utilize multiple scenarios that come from a real operation um, that are divided up into short video clips. And so we can take the resident down sort of a choose your own adventure book of making the right or the wrong decisions. What, what we can then do is, is bring it into a scenario where um, you've now resuscitated the patient, you've opened the patient up, um, gotten the heart restarted on the heart lung machine and here you can see the heart beating. If you look up a little bit you'll see the heart monitor. If you literally look up uh, right over the head there you'll see the heart monitor with a good EKG trace and if you look behind you you'll see the perfusionist. It's directly behind you. You have to really turn around and look. So this is really in 360. <laughs> so that's the person who's responsible for taking the patient off the heart lung machine. And what we want to see here is that a resident who's doing this really utilizes all of the information in 360 degrees. So uh, much like Uber is learning from where drivers look uh, to look at how to uh, work on self-driving cars, it's very important that we know that the residents are utilizing everything in 360 degrees, all information, uh, to be able to make decisions properly. So you did a great job. You got the heart restarted. You got the patient back on pump. And now if you look down at the field, you'll see the heart filling with blood and uh, we're off of the heart lung machine. Great job.